Hi, this is a tutorial on how to update the firmware on your GH4. Now, I'm getting ready for the, the V-Log, which is sort of back-ordered, or they, they do released it, and then they sort of took it back because it was a, a sort of a messed up release. So it says it's coming in December, and we're almost uh, halfway through December now. But in the meantime, um, I'm just going to show you how to get ready for that V-Log uh, uh, if you wish to purchase it. Now you're going to need an external recorder for it to actually be of any use. So if you don't have an external uh, recorder for your GH4, this probably doesn't really matter too much. Uh, but I will probably be getting an external recorder shortly after uh, the V-Log is actually finally released. So um, you can just sort of Google for firmware update. It'll take you to the Panasonic uh, website. Uh, firmware version, this is where we want the firmware download 2.4. 2.3 was the, uh, the one in between this one and this one was the mistake they made uh, and some people got vlog for free uh, at that point. So click there to download. We're going to want to go to the bottom of this page here and accept the agreement. Once you accept the, the agreement, you can, you're taken to this page and we're going to look for GH4. Click to go to the download page, which opens another window. And here we go. So this is the, uh, the information here down at the bottom. I'm on a Macintosh, so I'm going to download it. You may get a pop-up warning depending on what browser you are. Just accept, uh, accept this pop-up uh, to open. Okay, once that's downloaded, uh, we're going to want to extract the, the zip file. So once that's extracted, we have a uh, bin file, which we're going to want to put on our uh, SD card. So I'm going to take that and just put it on our SD card. And hopefully you've charged your battery, uh, so you're all ready for this update. You're going to want a fully charged battery to in your camera to, for this to work. So we'll go over to the camera now. Put your memory card in. Turn it on. And then press the play button. Then it comes to start version up. Yes. And basically you're going to wait about five minutes till it uh, does the updating. And one thing I didn't mention is that it's probably a good idea to put a Panasonic lens on the front uh, while you're doing the update, just to be on the safe side. So now the camera's all ready for vlog when that day comes. So you can now see under setup we have the activate button and of course import the activation code which I don't have but uh, that will come. Now your camera's all ready for vlog when it gets released in December, maybe push to January Looking forward to trying it out with an external recorder.